All new on First at Four, something amazing is happening this weekend, and you can follow along. Ingenuity, the helicopter that traveled to Mars that was attached to the Perseverance rover, will make its first flight. Team 12's Mitch Carr spoke with NASA about the mission and how it could help future missions to Mars. We really hope that this will turn out to be a real Wright Brothers moment and draw a lot of parallels between the very first flight of a powered aircraft on this planet with the very first flight of a powered air aircraft on any other planet. 118 years after human flight began, NASA is hoping to reach a new milestone as the Ingenuity helicopter takes to the sky above Mars. This time, though, we humans will have to watch from 33 million miles away with pre-programmed instructions. The helicopter wakes up executes that flight plan all by itself, completely autonomously, comes back, lands, and then when it's done, sends the signals back. NASA's research team hopes to figure out if this is even possible, and then it hopes to use Ingenuity to explore the red planet like never before, covering more terrain quicker than ever before. But the first flight will be simple. Well, as simple as it gets when Mars' atmosphere is thin enough that flying up there would be like flying a helicopter 100,000 feet above Earth which is currently not possible. A simple vertical rise, hover at about 10 feet off the ground for about 30 seconds, and then come back down. If all goes well, scientists hope to perform a series of test flights over the next month, each building in complexity. NASA hopes this first flight will pave the way for more ambitious aerial exploration of other planets in the future. And one final cool note, Ingenuity has attached to it a piece of fabric from the original Wright Brothers plane that flew at Kitty Hawk making human progress in the area of flight all the more apparent. Mitch Carr, 12 News. Boy, Ingenuity is such a great name for it as well. You can catch the first flight Sunday morning. We've put a link so you can follow the mission on 12news.com.